How's it going, all you guys and girls in the Illumination? Time to jump aboard the Loom Train. It's me, it's me, it's JJD, JJ Double J, the Illuminator here, the sweet one. Also known by almost countless other aliases and nicknames, but we won't get into that right now. It's very warm today. Uh, probably gonna break a record for today in the upper 80s. Uh, very, very warm today and tomorrow, and then we get back to normal. But Today I want to talk about a friend of mine, her and her husband decided to go out to a steakhouse. It's a chain of steakhouses around here. Um, at some point during their meal, what was described as a fire drill happened. Now, this is where I start to wonder, was it a fire drill or was it a real fire? Was it a real fire and the place tried to cover up or what? But you be the judge. Let me finish the story. At some point during this fire drill, um, everyone had to leave their meals, go outside for upwards of around 45 minutes. By the time everyone got back to their meals, obviously the steaks and potatoes, green beans, whatever, was obviously cold. Um, Apparently, this steakhouse did not want, when people asked if their food could be heated up, did not heat up anybody's food. They refused to do it, which left a bad taste in everyone's mouth, uh, not just from the grizzle, <laughs> maybe wrong choice of words. A lot of people were uh, peeved, to, to say the least, and a lot of people said they would never go back, but... I wouldn't, I don't understand how in a society where the customer is always right, you have a fire drill or a fire problem and then don't offer to heat up everyone's food. I mean, I'm, everyone wasn't asking for new steaks, new baked potatoes, whatever. They just wanted their food heated up. It caused a lot of people to say they'd never be back. Do you really want to lose business in this way? It just sounds like kind of kind of fishy, you know what I mean? Like someone needs a checkup from the neck up. And this manager, if this really was the way things happened, I, there has to be more to the story than meets the eye. I don't know, you be the judge. But anyway, let me know what you think. Feel free to put your comments below. Say la Burski, I'm off to the races. I love you all, stay safe. Have a good rest of the day. Be good to yourselves. This is The Illuminator and I'll be back. Phil? Hi! Phil Connors? I thought that was you!